So welcome to Techno Dad Life, where we build, learn, and create as a community. And today we have something very special for you. And so what we're going to be doing is installing Midnight Commander, which easy, you can use to easily transfer files back and forth on your server. If uh, Windows sharing is not working or you don't have it enabled, and also you can make new folders. And so what we're going to do is we're probably going to start using this in our different guides because it's a fast and easy way to create folders using a graphical interface. And if you haven't already, we have one week to go on the Bevy giveaway. So watch the last video to see how to do that. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell button. And if you like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And here we go now. And a special thank you to all my patrons who, without your support, this channel would not be possible. Thank you. So today what we're going to do is install Midnight Commander so that we can move files around and create folders very easily in Open Media Vault. And so first thing we're going to do is click on Shell in the box, click on Web Clients, and then we're going to log in as root and our server password. Then hit enter. And then we're going to type in app get update. And this will update our sources list. Then we're going to type in clear. And so now what we're going to type in is app get MC. And I already have it installed, so it's not going to install it. But this is what you will do. And then we're just going to type in MC. So a couple of different things on this page. Uh, I'm going to make this a little bit bigger so we can just see the one side here. Or actually, we can see both sides. Uh, so what we want to do is we see the light where the light blue is highlighted there. We want to just hit enter. And here you can see the main folders on our server. We're going to click to go down to shared folders and click on that. And then it shows us our shared folders. And we're going to do that the same as on the other side there. And how we move around, uh, I forgot to tell you, is you have to use the keyboard for this. And so to get to the other side, you have to tab and then use the up and down arrows to get where you want. Hit enter to highlight something. And so we're going to open our virtual folders. Okay, and so you see right now they are the same. So let's go down to app data. We have this transmission folder in there. So if you see the bottom of the screen, we have some choices. I'll make this a little bit bigger again. So we can edit, copy, move, make directory, delete, pull down, and quit. So what we're going to do is we're going to copy this folder to the other side. And so all we have to do is press F5 and then OK. And you can see it moves to the other side. If we want to delete it, we tab over, tab, tab down, highlight it, and then click F8. And yes. And now if we go back to our first folder, say we want to make a second folder here what we would do for that is f7 which is make directory and we have to backspace because it leaves the same name in there and then we'll call this open vpn and then click ok and there you can see it made another directory so this is very nice because you can make folders in a graphical way and it's very fast and that's it for today so make sure you like and subscribe and you have a great day bye bye